Nico absolutely popped off towards the end of 2021, making it clear that CSGO is not just the simple and Zywoo show. Top, though. Can they line up? Yep, Nico mowing them down. Triple, making a quad. So with a proven IGL and Alexi B and a prodigy opera and Munisi joining the team, will G2 be lifting trophies in 2022? I mean, it's definitely goal to perform, if not at the same level, but even better. That's why you make the changes to not stay on the same level, but to even do better, right? And I think uh, we have been consistent top three team in the world last year. Top three, top four. So the goal is definitely to do better. Nico has often had to carry his team to victory with his astounding play <laughs> it's such a hard position to clear out yeah. even with the ak's it's such a narrow gap and the scope just does give a bit of an advantage and even on the scope nico gonna be able to finish the round outrageous but with munisi so hyped up will nico have the freedom to perform even better so far i have been really impressed by how good he is for his age having him performing at the highest level obviously will take some pressure off my shoulders i think he will deliver really good and he looks like the guy he always he'll find a way to perform good somehow i think he will deliver massively he will have all the freedom to to do whatever he wants on the team as well what a nice move here from monacy to make sure that he can get in and try and help out uh, hunter who's inside of the bomb side he created a gap with a second oh, 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 he lands that shot on but that's a lot of pressure for the 16 year old so it's up to nico and his teammates to make him feel comfortable obviously i will like i'll try to be a guy for him to look up to i will do everything he needs from me i'll help him in any possible way i'll try to help him as much as i can while everyone is excited to see what munisi can do there has been some concerns about g2's other arrival i think alexi's got probably one of the toughest gigs uh ahead alexi b he's been airlifted out of og the ceo said we're gonna make rugger their coach uh more involved in the strats because they felt alexi b's playbook was overcomplicated in some areas and that's why they were struggling to execute that not all the players could get on that same page but alexi b was a little bit inflexible I go both long and man to hold van okay yeah they're gonna peak van when you contact out of long you're gonna kill the guy electric and man is gonna kill the guy backside yep Let's move too long, everyone, now. And back in 2019, when Nico was on phase looking for a new IGL, they had no interest in Alexi B. He told HLTV, We asked around to see if he would fit our team, and we basically decided he isn't the right fit for us. But things have changed now, and Nico thinks that people are wrong in their assumptions. Well, like, it was different type of players in phase as well, you know. We had a lot of big names in the team. It was hard. Like, he maybe wasn't so proven at the time as an IGL, right? So having him on the team with too, too many guys that are having, like, big voices, you know, maybe it could affect him, which was probably the biggest reason why we didn't go for him at the time. But now he has also proven himself that he's good IGL in uh, OG and uh, he's been delivering it. I think what people heard from him in a couple of, like, uh, clips that they have seen, it's not what he's doing a lot, I would say. You know, I think people are over-hyping it that he's, like, micro managing everything and everyone i don't think it's the deal so far and uh, he isn't that strict he's allowing players space that they want i would say so uh, so far uh, there was no any i would call it problems but there was no any like clashes but what he brings to the team is more structure having one voice in the team which we didn't have too much in the past i would say also he's the guy who is willing to sacrifice a lot for the team but uh, the one thing that we really looked into is having a like captain leadership you know and he's so far delivered it. 